the last couple of years a new technology is introduced into our industries LEDs light emitting diets light emitting diets are semiconductors so this means they work instantly when the power is applied light emitting diets emit we call it quasi monochromatic light which is a very narrow band of wavelengths actually LEDs UV LEDs are available and efficient in the UVA range starting at 365 nanometers going up to 405 nanometers in general the shorter the wavelength of the LED is the less effective the LED is meaning the effectivity is lower when the wavelength is lower to give you an example if you put in a hundred watt of electrical energy into a line of LEDs you will have a UV output of approximately 40% at a wavelength of 395 or 405 nanometers that decreases to approximately 60% of these 40% at 365 nanometers as the LEDs only emit a certain wavelength which is in the UVA range there's also no generation of infrared radiation which is the case with conventional gas discharge lamps and another important fact since the LEDs only work in UVA they are not generating ozone ozone is known as a variation of oxygen and ozone is generated only in a wave length below 250 nanometers the LEDs do not generate these wavelengths so ozone as well is not generated we already talked about functionality of LEDs um, we talked about wavelengths and uh, now it's time to discuss a little bit more about environmental issues uh, in a conventional UV system with uh, medium pressure lamps you will have uh, lamps with mercury inside and these lamps uh, emit due to the wavelengths they emit as well they generate ozone this is not the case with LEDs LEDs do not include mercury they do not uh, generate ozone due to the wavelengths this is clearly a beneficial uh, aspect in terms of environmental friendliness in addition to the environmental aspects the LED have a higher lifetime expectancy uh, we'll expect LEDs to have a lifetime of about or above 20,000 hours uh, compare that to a conventional uh, medium pressure bulb with about 1,000 to maximum 5,000 hours as the LED is a semiconductor uh, we can instantly switch it on and off we have no heat up phase like in conventional UV systems we also can uh, do format settings meaning if the printed sheet uh, is smaller than the maximum sheet size we switch off LEDs we have no mechanical parts in the LEDs so also in terms of maintenance uh, the LED has some benefits as the LEDs only emit um, UV radiation in the UVA sector you need adapted uh, consumables such as inks and coatings for these wavelengths this means the ink supplier has to modify his ink 
make it more reactive and make it more sensible in the UVA sector.